at my invitation, His Excellency President Yoweri Kaguta Museveni honored us by undertaking a state visit to Kenya. His visit underscores the profound significance we as leaders attach to the bilateral relations between Kenya and Uganda and to our shared commitment to further develop and grow our relations. Kenya and Uganda are firmly united by relations deeply rooted in shared history, culture, and aspirations for regional peace and prosperity. We recognize the importance of maintaining strong bilateral relations and are committed to expanding them for the mutual benefits of our two nations and our two peoples. I join His Excellency President Museveni in appreciating the significant outcome of the second session of the Joint Ministerial Committee held from May 12th to May 14, 2024 in Kampala, Uganda, which culminated in the signing of seven instruments of cooperation between our two countries. Consequently, we now have a memorandum of understanding to anchor cooperation between our foreign services institutions which ensure knowledge exchange and harmonization of structures and content of diplomatic training. Your Excellency, President Ruto, and all the dignitaries who are here, as you heard His Excellency summarized what we have agreed, the, the, the agreements, the protocols, uh, I don't want to repeat those. Uh, the only issue is for me to point out that all that is guided by the historical missions which the Africans have finally crystallized. More than 60 years ago, when we got independence, we did not harmonize properly on the, on, on the, on the historical mission beyond liberation. There was talk that time of Uhuru na Umoja, but it was not deeply uh, disassembled. What did Uhuru na Umoja mean? That's why, therefore, we have lost six decades. And as you can see in Africa, we have got so many uh, problems. The collapse of state authority in so many countries. This is not accidental. This is really, uh, 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 this was inevitable and it was predictable. This is the only way not to leave anybody behind. Yeah. And to, rem to remove the irrationality, you, you look at, at Africa. Africa really is amazing, and Latin America. Because Africa is one house, one building. Now, the sitting room is another country. The bedroom is another country. The other one is another country. Now, to go from the, the bedroom to the, to, 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 uh, to the outside, you must go through another country. You must go get a visa. You must get... What's this now? Eh? Uganda is part of Kenya and part of Tanzania and part of DRC. But we are in the, we are in the bedroom there. You fellows here, you are in the sitting room. Now, to go, to, to go out, we must, uh, we must knock. Please, can I go? Can I come to the sitting room? It, 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 it is so, so irrational, so irrational. So I thank His Excellency for inviting me, uh, 
please don't allow me to talk because if you give me audience, you do so at your own risk. <laughs> I can talk for ages. Thank you very much.